Hello, and welcome to another First Impressions video brought to you by MMO Play. It's here taking a look at a free-to-play browser-based RPG called The Pride of Tarn. It's a game originally out of Poland from a company called White Moon. It is gonna kind of have a dark setting with a turn-based fighting scenario. So here we go, just a tutorial teaching me the basics of the combat. You have 12 action points to spend. I can put them in defenses, which you can see right here. This is my melee defense. Next, I have ranged defense, and eventually magic defense over at the far end. Not to mention, I also do have attacks, which, well, I can't kill an enemy by just sitting there tiring them out. Although, I guess you can. You can run them out of endurance and then just go to town on them. You can see you got three stats. You have your health. You run out of health, you die. You got your mana. Well, can't cast spells without mana. And then you got endurance. Can't make attacks without endurance. So I guess theoretically I could probably just sit back and let him wail on me in full defensive mode eventually, just turn around and start smacking him. But, for now we're just gonna follow the tutorial, and then when I get out of it I'm probably just gonna go full on aggressive mode and try to just deal with these monsters. So you can see right now it's teaching me the defenses. I uh, blocked his melee attack, but then he uh, threw a stone at me. Now I'm gonna block his melee attack and his range attack, but, oh, I got hit with a spell. So this time it's going to say, hey, you should defend your spell. You can see I haven't used all my AP, my action points. I still have five left. So I'm going to spend two on magic defense, and then it leaves me with three, I'm guessing, next round for an attack. So you can see there's a little timer here. I got to set up all my defenses and attacks in time. You can actually set little prerequisites, or recommended scenarios. So those one and two are just kind of so you can see I can set my one, it has a certain, like, list of defenses and attacks, choose a different one. I can make my own, three, four, or I can just change one and two, which I'm not going to really look at, but trust me, you can do it. You can check the game out. I actually had a surprising amount of fun playing this game. So you can see right now I'm just setting a basic attack, my sword. So I'm going to go ahead and, when time runs out, block his attack and then smash him with my sword, hopefully. Oh, he hit me with a rock, but... And then we to each other. So you can see I gotta hit a little bit more at a sword attack. I gotta overcome his defenses. So it's kind of a guessing game here. We're trying to play off of each other's kind of mindset. Almost rock, paper, scissors like. We're, I'm trying to figure out what he's gonna do and trying to overcome it. He's trying to figure out what I'm gonna do and overcome it. Let's fast forward to an actual fight where I'm determining the outcome. Alright, here we go. You can see I'm in my house. It looks like we just got ransacked. There's uh, my character's mother. I'm gonna go talk to her. Looks like she has a quest for me. A little bubble, bubble text, a little bit of chatting. And then I'm gonna leave home and then go run her errand to go find apparently my character's brother. I made this character a fire mage. It didn't seem to have much in the way of options right now. I think it's eventually I'll start getting some spells right now. I only have one called War Cry, which is just pretty weak. It reduces their attacks. But. Here we go, we get into a little fight. So, we can go ahead and set our defenses, set our attacks. I'm just gonna do a couple of pretty strong attacks. Looks like I am running out of time though, I'm not gonna get anything off in time. There we go, uh, an arrow and a pebble. I kinda spread myself a little bit thin here, I probably... See, there we go. Two, two, and then three throws. That's the, the two one. Looks like he wasn't ready for Pebble. Now, the AI is basically going to react to your previous turn, so never do the same thing twice in a row. I'm going to hit that again, and then he's going to block it. So you kind of want to keep adjusting what you're doing and just kind of... It is a lot Rock, Paper, Scissors-ish. It's sort of a mind game. So he's going to block all three, and then he's going to probably uh, hit me. He's going to focus more on a couple of attacks. And this is definitely an MMO. You can see here's another player here. It looks like you can attack players, but I can't right there because there is a guard. He uh, he wouldn't appreciate that too much. So um, he's actually his job right now is to keep me from going north. I don't want to do that. So let's just listen to what he has to say and go find something else to do. And here's about ten more minutes into the game. At this point, I've realized that these monsters are really weak and they're never prepared for melee attack. So yeah, I just did that. That's a thing. So at least early on, the monsters you can just basically one round them before they can hit you. This next one right here, maybe not quite so much. It does look like range attacks get to go first. I'm just going to sit here and make three melee... Eh, let's go with four melee attacks, three strength each. But, he's going to go away and take a pot shot. 
He's gonna truck a rock at me, and then I'm gonna go and destroy him, but he did get to do some damage to me. You do have to rest, you don't naturally regain hit points. Click the game, check it out. It's available for free. It's called Pride of Terran. It's a pretty fun little strategic game. Like the content, stay tuned to my videos from MMO Play. Thanks for watching. I gotta go break the news to her now.